What's going on everybody? Upgrade guy here and today I'm going to hit you with 10 secret features that you didn't even know your Nvidia Shield TV has. That's right, the Nvidia Shield TV is one of the powerhouse streaming devices on the market. It's been around for years and it's continued to get better and better with each new model that's released. But with there being so many features, it means users can be extremely overwhelmed with how many different features it actually has as the typical user only really uses it for streaming. But the Nvidia Shield TV Pro and other models actually offer so much more than you realize. And today I'm gonna to be bringing you through some of those features that will help you and give you a better experience with your Nvidia Shield TV. Like always guys, smash that subscribe button down below. It really helps the content on a ton. Give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to comment down below if there's a feature that I missed in this video and one that you want me to cover in the future. As well, guys, don't forget to subscribe to my other channel, Upgrade Guy Tech Reviews, where I do reviews on all sorts of devices. It's, it's linked just down below in the description. It would help me out a ton. Let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, everybody. So let's go ahead and get into the number 10 feature that you might not have known existed. Now, some of these T features are a little more basic and you might know about them, and some of them are a little more complicated. So just keep that in mind as we go through this list. Not every single one may be the feature for you. So this first one to do it, you just have to go into settings and we're gonna check out AI upscaling. Now, not a lot of people know what AI upscaling it is, but let me break it down for you very quickly. Basically what it does is it takes content that's not necessarily 4K or let's say 1080p content, and it's gonna enhance it and upscale it which is gonna make it a better quality all around. So you're gonna get a better visual experience. So you can just go into settings and you can put it on basic, enhanced, or AI enhanced, which is the one I suggest. And then you can pick which detail enhancement you want. And I usually set mine to eye high. Now you can also go to enable demo mode and turn it on. Now, whenever you're watching video that is compatible with this, so a lot of stuff on Netflix, you would simply press the three line button at the top and it would toggle it between AI and basic mode, which is gonna show you essentially what the difference is. And if you hold it down, you're gonna see a side-by-side -side view of these two different contents. So this is really gonna show you how that visual enhancement happens when you're using AI upscaling. So now let's go ahead and move to the number nine hidden feature that you didn't know existed on the Nvidia Shield TV. Okay guys, and let's talk about feature number nine. Now this is a super simple one and you're, some of you might call me brain dead for bringing this up, um, but it's one that I think a lot of people don't actually know. And that's because a lot of people don't actually investigate their Nvidia Shield TV Pro. They get it, they install Netflix, and that's where the investigation ends. So they don't actually go into a deep dive on what the Shield can do. So that's why I'm here teaching you these quick trigger features that can get you going and get your Nvidia Shield TV working better than ever. So feature number nine, on your Nvidia Shield TV remote, you will see a little circle button. So it just looks like a little shaded in circle. What you're gonna do is double click that. Now this is gonna bring up this menu. Now I'm sure you've accidentally brought this up before uh, and you've just ignored it and probably pressed back. But why this is important is because you can close your application from here. Why is it important to close your applications? Well, because when you have too many applications open, your device is gonna run slower because it's still running those processes in the background. So you need to make sure at all times you're closing these applications and this is the actual way of closing them, not just backing out of them. So make sure you're doing this whenever you have too many applications open. You can see I was really bad here, um, but do this as often as possible and your Nvidia Shield TV Pro will continue to run fast. Now let's go ahead and move into NVIDIA Shield TV trick number eight. Okay guys, now let's go ahead and get into hidden feature number eight. And this is a feature that before you would have, you know, back in the, let's say, early 2000s, mid 2000s, you would have needed a separate device for it. But now a lot of devices actually allow this capability. Um, so it makes it so you just need one device for all your home uh, media needs. And that is built in Chromecast. That's right. Your Nvidia Shield TV Pro is also a built-in Chromecast and you're able to just stream media directly off of your devices. So I'll give you a little example here. I'm on my phone and I'm going to go ahead and pull up one of my videos. Now, once you're in that approved app that allows for casting, 
All you have to do is click the little Chromecast button and it will give you the option of approved devices you have connected. I will just click the shield and now you can see here it is. It's What's going on everybody? Device Upgrade guy phone. here and in and today's video we're going to be hitting you with the top to five downloader codes well. plus some now bonus ones and get of August 2021. The number seven hidden feature for your NVIDIA Shield TV Pro that you didn't know existed. Let's check it out. All right, guys, and moving into hidden feature number seven, and it's not really so much of a feature, but it's something you should always have with your NVIDIA Shield or with your Fire TV stick, and that's a VPN, and not just any VPN. You need the fastest, most secure VPN, and I suggest IP Vanish, guys. It's one of the best. They also just started the beta program for WireGuard. You can check that out on my YouTube channel if you're interested in it. And we have a crazy $93 off discount just down below in the description. Um, it's only offered to Upgrade Guys subscribers, so go ahead and click that link, guys. The best part about a VPN is you can also ungeolock content from apps such as Netflix, Disney+, Plus, Prime Video, um, Dazan, whatever applications you have that geo-restrict content from other countries, a VPN helps you unlock that. So if you want a VPN, guys, if you want the best deal for a VPN, make sure you check it out down below in the description and get that deal before it's gone. Let's go ahead and move on to number six. All right, everybody. So now let's go ahead and get into hidden feature number six. Now, this is one to clean up the clutter that is available on your top scrolling menu. So when I say top scrolling, I mean all this stuff down here where you see your feature, where it shows all the stuff from your official applications, um, whether that be Tubi, whether that be Prime, whether that be Netflix, you can see all this stuff right here. And this can get annoying because you might not use every app all the time. You might just want it to show one. So you can actually scroll all the way down to customize channel. Now from here, we can either get rid of all of them if we want. So you can see as I'm removing them, they're disappearing. Or you can keep just the ones that you want. So if you just want Prime, you can keep Prime. You'd have to go in and close the rest of these, right? So we'll close all the ones from YouTube. Uh, we'll close, let's see, NVIDIA Games. Boom. We'll close there. Boom, boom. And we still have one more open right here. Boom. And boom. Now when we go to this menu, except for Apple still showing, oh, that's App Spotlight. So now when we go to this menu, you can see everything's cleaned up, guys, and you only have the available sections. That you this really cuts down the time you need scrolling, and it just looks a lot cleaner overall on your main menu. So make sure you clean up and customize your channel. Now let's go ahead and move into tip and trick number five. Let's check it out. All right, guys. So now we're moving into tip and trick number five. Make sure you stick around to the end of the video because there's some really good ones at the end that I think some of you guys are really going to want to check out. Um, ones that might change how you use your NVIDIA Shield. So stick around, guys. Does not take long. And make sure you subscribe down below right now if you're enjoying this video. If you're not, then I don't know, man. Just, just unsubscribe or leave or something. I don't know. Let's go ahead and get into it. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go into settings and this one is developer options. Now you first have to access developer options by activating it. So you wanna to go to device preferences and then we wanna to go to about. And from here you wanna scroll down until you see build and you wanna click on it. Now you can see it says no need, you're already a developer, but you wanna press it around five times and it will let you become a developer. From here you'll click back and scroll down until you find developer options. Now there's all sorts of things you can change inside developer options from performance um, to making the animations in between clicks change. So what I would suggest is make sure you key out what you're changing. So then if you mess something up, you can always go change it back because some of these things you're, you're really not going to know what they do. So I would only suggest playing with the ones that you read over like in here during drawing, such as transition animation scale. You can see I have all these off. Um, but yours will be turned on. So those are good ones to turn off. There's also some performance things down below that you can try and test out and see if it increases your performance. Now let's go ahead and get into hidden tip and trick number four. Let's check it out. All right, guys, now we're moving into hidden tip and trick number four, hidden features that you did not know existed on your NVIDIA Shield or little tips and tricks to help you out and keep your device running fast. Now this one involves just downloading one app from the Google Play Store, and this is more or less if you want your device running fast, if you want to keep it clean, you don't want too much junk on it, you're going to go to the Google Play Store, and then from here you're going to search up FX File Explorer. You can use any file explorer you want, but I find FX is one of the best. You would go ahead and simply install it. You can see I already have it installed. 
Now, most of the files you're gonna to wanna to delete and clean your system on are under the download section. So you'd open it up, you can see mine's already clean, but all you do is hover over the item, hold down the okay button until it's down, until it's highlighted, and then go over to this left-hand side to options and you'll see a delete option here. So go ahead and delete any files you have in there that you don't need anymore um, and keep your device clean and running fast, especially with the limited storage of the NVIDIA Shield TV Pro. You wanna keep it so you don't have too much stuff bloating up your storage. Now let's go ahead and move into hidden tip and trick number three. And I highly suggest sticking around for trick number one. Let's go ahead and get into number three. All right, everybody, and moving into hidden feature number three. Now, some of you guys are gonna laugh at me for this one, uh, but I really think not a lot of people utilize this on your NVIDIA Shield TV Pro. Um, the fact of the matter is the NVIDIA Shield TV Pro at its core was built as a gaming machine. So as a different gaming option, kind of as an emulation station in a sort of way. Um, but it's evolved past that. Most people just use it for streaming now. But did you know your kids can play really high high quality games like Fortnite, you can play Apex Legends. There's tons of games that they would usually need a PC for or you know an expensive console for, but you can play it directly on your NVIDIA Shield by just going to NVIDIA Games. Now mine needs an update, so we won't go too much into it, uh, but you'd simply scroll through here, guys, sign up for an account, and you can basically get any game you want. Um, well, not any game, but a ton of them you want um, completely without any cost to yourself. So make sure you check out NVIDIA Games. Guys, hidden feature number three, really, really good that more people need to take advantage of. Let's go ahead and get into number two, and then we'll do number one, which all of you guys are going to absolutely love. Let's check it out. Okay, guys, and coming in at secret tip and trick number two, and this is one, if you guys watch my channel, you already know this. Uh, and you already know what you're doing with this. But if you don't, guys, then I would highly suggest checking out my other videos because it's going to give you a more in-detail look on what exactly uh, this does for you. So you need to go to the Google Play Store and you need to start by installing Downloader. Now, Downloader is um, just a browser that lets you easily download and sideload uh, different apps directly off the internet. Um, or files, whatever you want to get off the internet. So you just go ahead and install it. And then from here, guys, I suggest checking out my other videos, um, whether that's on AppLink, whether that's on Unlinked, whether that's on File Synced. Uh, you can find tons of them on my channel. So go check those out, guys, and you'll get more details into what to do uh, with Downloader. So make sure you check that out, guys. This is the number two tip and trick. Um, and I really, really suggest looking more into this by watching the rest of the videos on my channel um, because you're going to be pleasantly surprised. Now let's go ahead and move into the number one tip and trick that you need to know on your NVIDIA Shield. Now let's go ahead and check it out. All right, guys, let's go ahead and move into that number one tip and trick. And this is one that I guarantee you, you haven't used uh, and you probably just used a USB until this point. But after watching this video, I can almost promise that you're gonna be using this tip uh, way more often than you would have thought. So you're gonna to go to settings, and then from here, we're gonna to go to device preferences. And then what we wanna do is find storage. So we'll find that right here. And then you can see transfer files over local network. And you can go ahead and turn that on or turn that off. And when I click on it, you can see it gives me a username, a password, and then your IP address. Now what you're gonna to have to do is follow a number of steps and it really doesn't take long at all. Go to your computer and you can actually wirelessly transfer files from your computer directly to your NVIDIA Shield TV Pro with just one click. So it's that simple guys, there's no more grabbing a USB, transferring it over, right? This just transfers over your Wi-Fi network. So it's super simple guys and it's gonna save you a ton of time going forward with your NVIDIA Shield TV Pro guys. And this is it, that was the top 10 hidden features, tips and tricks, whatever you want to call them of your NVIDIA Shield TV Pro that you might not have known. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to smash subscribe before you leave today. Really helps out the content a lot. Uh, and I will catch you guys in the next video.